don't, 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 don't stop the beat. I can't, 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 can't see my feet. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing up there? Get down here. I'm beatboxing to his rhythmic motions up here. Why do you sound like, why do you sound like our king? I can't even see you now. <laughs> He's just having a long distance conversation on your behalf. <laughs> Wait, so are we talking about Link talking or the king? The king. Oh. He's speaking for you. He's ventriloquisting. I will speak on his behalf. <laughs> oh, God. We're gonna have to get more statues for him. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna... <laughs> yeah, he does eat statues. <laughs> oh. yep. Those poor artisans. You came all the way here, but I was, but it was in vain. I have no desire to speak with you. Well, that's not very nice. Jeez. Well, <laughs> Listen well, Muzu. There's something you need to know. He who stands here, the man called Link, is the one whom my sister, Mifa, in case you weren't paying attention, Link and my sister Mifa had feelings for. Wait, so Mifa had feelings for herself I was too? Own yes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It I was didn't a, know she was into that. It was a selfless and a selfish type of affair. <laughs> <laughs> Get it? Selfish. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> anyway, so I did not know it myself at the time, but it is so. I grew up hearing my father tell stories, of, some of which were too graphic for me to recall. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Gee! Why would the king tell you that? <laughs> you cannot fool me with such a, a stupid lie. Not this Zora. Everybody knows we reproduce asexually. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. They lay eggs or something, probably. <laughs> I'm sure they do. <laughs> How could Lady Mephas possibly have feelings for this highly, a uh, highly like him? <laughs> the facts are clear. He knows. He remembers nothing. Not even uh, Princess Mephas statue. I'm trying to. Re I'm trying to be able to read the subtitles. <laughs> yeah, the, the bright light makes it a little hard to read the text. <laughs> the, the bright light right behind it. <laughs> it is true, Muzu. Though you never knew it, and you have a slight stutter for some reason, he was ever in Mifa's heart. <laughs> and Link is just like, yeah, yeah, I'll accept <laughs> that, even though I don't remember it. <laughs> <laughs> the statue. That of is a there. nice statue. Though. That is an insanely nice statue. It's like, why isn't that an amiibo or statuette or something? Because that'd be awesome to have on a desk. <laughs> Bring my statue, I'm gonna eat it! <laughs> Bill, Bill, <all> <laughs> it's like the statue is specifically reserved for him to eat. <laughs> oh, we're regaining a memory. Oh, it's pretty. That's one of the divine beasts. He's a big old elephant. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's adorable. I was thinking. This reminds me of the time we first met. Oh, that's Mifa. Oh, wow, she's known me a while then. Damn. Every time I would heal you, just as I'm doing right now. Aw, thank you. That is quite handy to have as an ability. <laughs> yeah, it is. You looked grown up so much faster than I did. So, does, do y'all live, like, insanely longer than Hylians, then? I would imagine so. I mean, like, the the father and Prince Sidon, like, they've been around for over a hundred years, and they're still just fine. Like, Sidon, ex especially, like, he still looks very young yeah, after Yeah, he still years. Se feels like a, like a slightly older teenager. Yeah, so I feel like, uh, I feel like Zoras are very much similar to, like, a, an elfin type race in that regard, where, like, they live way longer yeah instead of a yuppie they call them guppies <laughs> <laughs> wait so they call hylians guppies no 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 young professionals like prince sidon <laughs> oh <laughs> he's a guppy he's a guppy <laughs> guppy sidon <laughs> I love how Sidon has just become like a fan favorite. Oh yeah, he he took off in the community extremely well. <laughs> I saw I saw a post on Facebook. It was like it was like uh, that scene from the Sorcerer's Stone. It was like it was like Link talking to Professor D Professor Dumbledore, and he, and he was like, Professor, 
What does this mirror show us? He's like, it shows us nothing more or less than the deepest and most desperate desires of our hearts. And he looks in the mirror and it's Prince Sidon doing his pose. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yes. <laughs> What's the matter, Link? Are you unwell? Did you remember my joke about fish sticks? <laughs> 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 you really like hatch what <laughs> whatever is this matter what <laughs> what <laughs> what's just happened in your brain <laughs> just trying to read the just subtitles like, like a million synapses misfired <laughs> <laughs> okay you are quivering like a hatchling what is the matter <laughs> i remembered what <laughs> do not mistake me for a fool hylian there's no way you could have remembered her just now when it's most convenient. Huh? In any case, I mean, without any solid proof, I cannot possibly mm. take you on your word. If you have any such proof, now is the time to show it. Uh, I was just gifted armor? That's true. <laughs> you need to, I. That's right, you need to talk to them with the armor. Oh. You wear the armor, and then that'll be the proof. Oh. Put it on. Put it on! Uh, which one is it? That one. Uh, this one. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> These buttons. You were are playing all... this game like yesterday. These buttons are all wonky. Actually, I haven't played this game in a week. <laughs> really? Yeah. I, I remember seeing you playing it like the other day. Yeah, I wasn't playing it. Oh, so was that like? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Muzu, look closely at the clues. Wow, that for some reason did not roll off the tongue well. Look closely at the clothes <laughs> that Link is wearing. <laughs> you really think wearing those clothes is going to make me... Damn, he looks good! <laughs> Damn! You're looking fine, son! <laughs> Shit! How do you look so good in those duds? <laughs> Lady Mifa made this armor by hand, and yet it fits you perfectly. I grew into him. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? Ah, so uh, now do you understand? Do you not? Now you know who her heart belonged to and whom she made this special armor for. The fact that this armor fits Link perfectly should be proof enough that Mifa made it for him and him alone. You have always disliked Hylians, even before the Great Calamity. That is why Mifa never told you. Uh, hmm. Now that you know, you're going to listen to me, right? <laughs> <laughs> You're going to believe me just because of this. Just please, tell me where I can get the shock arrows. Please. Please. Knowing you, I bet you already figured it out. Now, why, for some reason, has nobody in our entire race been born as an electric eel man? <laughs> they would be most helpful right about now. <laughs> I mean, he does have a stingray for a head. Yeah, but that doesn't mean he, he won't conduct electricity like a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> But that doesn't, like, that means that he could also produce electricity. I don't, well, no, stingrays do not produce electricity. <laughs> what, don't some of them have, like, an electric sting? No, they just have a stinger with poison. <laughs> I must be thinking of jellyfish or they, something. They, they paralyze your nervous system sometimes. <laughs> but they don't just straight up shock you. <laughs> I, I know that there's, like, something that, like, stings you and shocks you like that. I mean, Well, I know there's like, probably some kind of eel. <gasps> but, uh... I never, I never would have imagined that she would make special armor for you. It's like, why are you stuttering? <laughs> Aww. He really did care for her. Yeah. That's, that's very clear. He's just so caught up in his ways. Yeah. I do not approve of seeking help from a hiding, and I suppose it's our only option at this point. Cool, so he's going to help us get the shock arrows. Sweet. Okay. That's good, because we need them. Yeah, we definitely need them. We definitely need them shock arrows. I am a proud Zora. That means that I take responsibility for my... I still, I'm still, i still having a hard time reading that with a light Somebody on turn it. off that light! <laughs> it's I distracting me. <laughs> I, can't, I can't make out what I'm saying. <laughs> it's like there's an anglerfish Zora just dangling it off the edge. <laughs> 
God, can you imagine that? An anglerfish lure is just scary as shit. Oh, God. It just has that, like, huge underbite with all the teeth. <laughs> God, no. God, that's a Zora I want to see. <laughs> I'm sure it would probably exist. I mean, there's a Zora... Like, the Zora seems... Like, each one seems to be based on one sea creature after another. I mean, like, Muzu is obviously, like, based off of a stingray. Uh, Sidon is obviously based off of, like, a hammerhead shark. Mm-hmm. I mean, each one is like, got a specific trait to them that identifies them with, like, a fish. Yeah. So, it wouldn't surprise me to see one of an angler <laughs> fish. That tall mountain over yonder. It is called Ploymus Rock, or Mountain. Sorry. It's not a rock. It's a lot bigger than that. <laughs> you also find, uh, the, the, what, what's it called? Uh, something point. Uh, Shadowback Point. That's the one! <laughs> It's a, there's a terrifying creature that's made its home up there. Sweet. <laughs> it's got the shock arrows. You might want to be careful. He's gonna shoot it. He's gonna shoot all his shock arrows at you. Why doesn't he just shoot them off the edge then? Just like kind of rain down thunder arrows on the Zoro's domain. He will eventually. He's just waiting for the right day. <laughs> <laughs> he's waiting for the rain to stop. Aha! <laughs> <laughs> so wait, shouldn't we just let the rain continue to fall at that point? <laughs> you must mean that Lionel. He is a man beast, that one. Oh god, Lionel. Just kind of like we're how fish man. <laughs> The beast does it makes sense. We're related. <laughs> <laughs> that beast does indeed wield shock arrows. That is certainly one way to collect them quickly. So just yep. stand up there with no armor. I'm pretty sure you'll catch a couple in the chest. <laughs> 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 he is vicious to be sure, but I am certain Link will rise to the challenge. Oh God, Lionel's in this game, man. Hell yeah, Lionel's in this game. I are love you? fighting me some Lionels. Have fun trying to fight him with four hearts. <laughs> oh yeah, that that is a thing that we currently have. <laughs> Honestly, you might want to like make some kind of hearty stuff to like give yourself some bonus hearts. Yeah, maybe. But where's the fun in that? In order to appease the divine beast, <laughs> I estimate that you will need mm, at least twenty shock arrows. <laughs> maybe a hundred. <laughs> Do you think you can gather that many? Mm, I'll see what I can do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as everybody's g coming down with a case of the more shoes. <laughs> everybody in this, everybody in Zora's domain is catching the more shoes. It's like they start every sentence with them. They're just slowly like electric footballing backwards. Just. <laughs> 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 Meanwhile, Morshu is like in the back, and he's like, "Why does why does everybody in this town sound like me? You're all crazy." <laughs> mm. <laughs> it's like you you say everybody here is crazy for sounding like that, but yet you do the same thing. Mm, I don't think so. <laughs> well, why do you still doubt him, Muzu? I have no doubt he will be triumphant. <laughs> okay, Link, let's get moving before we come down with a case of the more shoes. <laughs> the fastest way to ploy miss plimilis plabadus. I'm coming down with the more shoes. Platypus Mountain is <laughs> to ascend the waterfall east of the domain. <laughs> I couldn't get that word out for some reason. <laughs> Editor, give me a picture of Death Mountain with the head of a platypus on it. <laughs> <laughs> it's Platypus Mountain. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> that sort of armor should come in quite handy. It might not make you look like a platypus, but it should allow you to swim up to the waterfall basin. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Platypus Mountain. <laughs> All the way to East Reservoir Lake. <laughs> right by the Divine Beast. Gather at least 20 shock arrows and then come join me. All right. Platypus Mountain is the only place where you can be healed at the Morshoes. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Go throw that monstrous beast off Platypus Mountain and then we'll defeat that Divine Beast. <laughs> that way we can go up to the mountain and cure ourselves in the Morshoes. <laughs> yeah, that's how it's 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 uh, transmitted through the rain. <laughs> it's transmitted through the rain, and the only way to be cured is to go up the platypus mountain. <laughs> so the only one that's safe is that guy, <laughs> the Goron. The Goron over there, because he's not a Zora; he's a Goron. Yep. <laughs> All right, we're gonna make our way up the platypus mountain next time on Rogues and Role Players. <laughs>
Because we gotta cure ourselves of some more shoes. <laughs> God. Editor, give me a picture of more shoe on the end slate. Thank you. <laughs> 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 Plymouth, 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 Platypus Mountain. <laughs> I couldn't say Plymouth for some reason. <laughs>